Okay, welcome back to Let's Play Amnesia. This time I'm playing in the dark, gonna give that a try. Um, uh, previously I'd thought, well, there, I won't be able to see the keyboard because it's not backlit, but I think there's enough light from the um, monitor, at least in these lit up areas, that um, I'll give it a try. And there's not so many controls to the game that I will um, not be able to... Uh, figure that figure out which ones I'm pressing, <laughs> which buttons I'm pressing. Um, after all, if I can type without looking at the keyboard, I should be able to play the game without looking at the keyboard. I'm just doing a little bit of a search, trying to find this key still in the bedroom here, but I think... Someone's coming. Really? Do I have to hide in the closet again? I think I have to hide in the closet again. Yeah. Oh shit. Close the frickin' door. <laughs> yeah. Um <laughs> I'm like afraid to move now. <laughs> be okay. Don't see anybody. <sighs> well, I haven't had any luck yet finding this key in here. Um, so, I think I'm gonna give it a break for a little bit. Um, take another stab at the um, creepy uh, storage area. Ew. Oh. Ugh. Frickin' piece of bloody flesh. <laughs> okay, enough messing around. <sighs> Gotta be serious going in here. Is this the storage area? Yeah. Oh gosh, I don't want to go back in here. Okay, I'm gonna whip out a um, lantern. Actually, wait. I don't want to have that out in here because the thing will see me. Hmm. I'll just risk it in the dark then. how long I could stay in the darkness without totally losing it. Probably not long. Um, okay, this is really dark. Oh god. Please, let me go! I won't tell anyone, I swear! I just want to go home! No! Get away from me! Horrifying. Ugh. 
Uh, won't budge, okay. Another way around. Doesn't look like we can really get through there. What does that say? Machine parts. Okay, equipment. Uh, super dark, how are we doing? Oh, just a slight headache, okay. I'm so on edge because I think at any moment... I'm not going into that room where the um, sobbing noise is coming from. Is this the other door? No, it can't be. Oh, that's a dark room. That taste, that fragrance, the master's rose. I couldn't really understand that. What is that? A drill part? Okay. Some items can be combined. You could drag and drop one onto another. There's a. Okay. Can't assemble the drill yet. Valve has been rusted shut, okay. Sanity is waning here. another drill part, I think. Yep. Can I assemble the drill yet? Yeah, okay. So we have a hand drill now. Does that do anything to the rusty tap? Rusted shut. Uh... There we go. Um, oh gosh, it's water. Why would, why, why would you do that? Why would you, secondary, why would you do that? <laughs> I don't want any water out here. Okay, a pitch dark room. They're all pitch dark, I suppose. I'm kind of losing track of where I've have and haven't been. Oh, I don't want to go in there. Okay, here's a letter. Regarding explosive mixture. Alexander, I have prepared the explosives you needed for clearing the flood drain. I can't stress enough how important it is that the mixture is handled with care. Please tr try to tell your feather-brained servants this before you go ahead with your plans. The liquids are not by themselves explosive and should be kept separated to avoid further mishaps. I have arranged two large vats in the next room for the ingredients. All you need to do is mix the liquids and you are ready to go. Okay, so I think um, we may have already mixed the secondary liquid. Let's start that. Um, 
or not mixed it, but we, you know, we have, um, got it flooding out into the space here. <laughs> so that may or may not be a good thing. Um, considering it's explosive. Precious items. I could move a bunch of boards and maybe have a fire that burns strategically. I don't know why I would want that yet, but just looking at what's around. So, what is our. Yeah, we're freaking out. What is our objective? We've got one vat. Let's first of all see if there's another vat that's interactive in here. Ah, yes. Here we go. Primary. Okay. So if I start this, something will probably explode. So is there anything else? Oh, there's a... Where do these stairs go? This goes back up to the same area, doesn't it? Yeah. Okay, I'm silly, those are the stairs that came out. Like I said, I'm getting turned around in the dark. Okay, so... I think we've gone into all the side doors. Yeah. Been in that room. Okay. So I don't see why we shouldn't go ahead and mix these because it might possibly cause an explosion that will open the way to the, uh, well, the room we haven't gotten into, not the equipment room, but. I should go ahead and clear the way, though. There may be a small explosion. I'm wondering if those liquids are going to mix, or maybe I need to... You know, maybe I need to mix them myself. Let's see. Okay. Partially filled pa- okay, alright, here we go. <sighs> but, this is gonna- is this gonna kill me? <laughs> I mean, well, we'll see. Picked up explosive. Okay, I guess since it's contained... Uh, I'm gonna try using it. I wish that I could move faster. Does it say a, a highly volatile mixture? I if we have to ignite it. I 
Oh, maybe if I put it next to this candle. No object to use the item on. Don't stand too close to the blast when the explosive goes off. Okay. Is it gonna go off on its own, or...? Uh, <laughs> I feel like I have to do something else. Do not set off the explosive before you are safely out of the blast area, but how do I set it off? Hmm. Okay, maybe I don't have everything I need. Hmm. <laughs> I could pick up a torch or something else. Hmm. Well, I may need to go back to that, um, room and find the key to the... So, like, the rubble from the cave-in, find a way to get through, an important key is hidden. Find another way around the rubble in the study. Find the key that unlocks the door. Okay, so I have to do all this stuff, so... Let's see. much luck finding this key. An important key hidden in the guest room. It's hidden. Oh, that thing's back up here. I threw you down. I threw you down here. Disgusting. gonna check that the game sound isn't too loud. Okay, it's good. <sighs> so I'm thinking I should look in places that aren't obvious. Key hidden in the guest room. Mm. Oh, I can start the fire. Ooh. up so I can get on top of the... <laughs> trying to use this as a ladder and actually get it... I think I can actually get it in the right shape. I wonder if I can, I wonder if I can burn it. For no reason, just see if it would burn. Nope. Okay, work on solving the puzzle. So there's a key hidden. What the heck is it? I don't like not being able to find things. Makes me feel silly. So it might be behind one of the paintings.
I want to see if there's anything on top of this wardrobe. Just build myself a little crude ladder. <laughs> nope. What about... Painting movable at all? It's a freaky painting. Crucifixion always like really um unsettles me. Oop. It doesn't look like this key is on top of anything. <laughs> oh man. I'm gonna break everything in here just looking for it. What about a book? Do I have to pull out a book? Solve all these puzzles, but if something is hidden, I just oh, I have so much trouble finding it. If I don't find it soon, I'm afraid I'll look it up because, uh, I don't so much like being lost. <sighs> oh, here we go. I figured it might have been behind oh, a painting. Thank God, there it is. I guess it is a good place to hide it then. The key. Ah, yes. Machine room key. All right. So I think we're done in this room then. Hopefully that raised our sanity up a little bit. I think it was getting thin there, yeah. Well, we've back down to a headache. Alright, so we have the key to the machine room. What is our other... Rubble from the cave-in, find another way. Find the key that unlocks the door leading to the machine room. Done. Okay. Is the machine room in here? I think it's in... That's where it was. Machine room. But I have... To oh yeah. Okay. He had to heavily try his best to keep himself from screaming. Needed some sedatives, apparently. Alright, game. Do your best. Do your worst. It's scaring me. Huh? What are you gonna do? Make some creepy crawly thing crawl at me? Flood the room? That would probably freak me out a little bit. Can't do anything with those cranks. They like the sound of a child's scream. I mean, maybe that's a child's laughter. 
Oh, hi. Pressure. Oh, Roman numerals, okay. Uh, I don't actually know what I'm doing there. I think I should wait till I have more information. Is that wall coming alive? Slightly disturbing. <sighs> What's this? Schematics? Okay, here's a note. 5th of July, 1839. Today I went to the university looking for answers. I was able to sneak into Herbert's office and pick up an address book along with some relevant textbooks. Professor Taylor at the Faculty of History was very helpful and I managed to approach the subject of the orbs. The most interesting aspect was the prevalent trace they had left in our culture. The mythic orbs may in fact have inspired the Globus Cruciger which so many royal regalia holds to this day. In ancient times, the orbs were held by priests as a symbol of the sun and its power. As I was leaving, I overheard a disturbing conversation. Sir William Smith, the geologist, was killed last night. Less than a fortnight had passed since I'd asked for his expertise. I know it's silly, but I can't help feeling responsible somehow. Hmm. Okay, so there's pressure valve knob things in there. Not quite sure how to use them. Or what they do, rather. Um. I'm a little worried, actually, that I haven't seen any weird monster things in a while. Means one is right around the corner. A giant cog. Flow, okay. Looks like something's missing from there. Machine Equipment Memo. Note that there are only two spare rods left in the storage for the elevator machinery. Make sure to only discard the ones which are badly damaged and keep the others in the inner study rooms in case all three would crack again. Okay, so there might be some more rods for that in the study, I guess. 14th of July, 1839. I've read every book I can find on the subject. While rich in legend and hearsay, my knowledge is lack for the insight I crave. I've sent letters to many in Herbert's address book and received answers of varying importance. Today, I got one which differed greatly from the others. From a baron in Prussia. He said nothing about the quaint stories of priests in underground temples. He didn't even mention them. He simply wrote, I know. I can protect you. Come to Brennenburg Castle. Signed, Alexander. What am I to make of this? Protect me from what? Is someone after me? I looked up Brennenburg and traced it to the Prussian woods near the Baltic Sea. While being the least informative letter I've received, it causes me greatest distress and interest. As I write, my thoughts are drawn to my nightmares in which a most disturbing sound calls to me. A sound defying description. A voice from the void. The last few weeks have been awful with so many sleepless nights dreading a repeat of those horrid dreams. Tomorrow, I shall visit my physician, Dr. Tate, in hope that he can provide me with sedatives to help me sleep. That's some sedatives, huh? Okay, so... Yeah, I'm thinking that there might be Something in the study. Something in the study that we need. Wait a minute. Where does this go? That room looks a little bit disturbing. Uh. Seventeenth of 
July 1839. How has this escaped me? They're all dead. Limbs scattered, heads split down the middle, their skin flayed as if boiled. I feel like I'm falling into myself. What's happening? Sir William Smith, Professor Taylor, now Dr. Tate. Is it following me? How can it not be? It's the damn thing I brought from Africa. Something is after me. I have no choice but to trust the Baron. He better know what he claims. If he is wrong, I suspect he'll regret it as well. Okay. Well, I think it's not really providing any new information. We figured out something's definitely following us. And I guess it's from Africa. So there's cogs, but I don't know if we have to actually move them anywhere. Put that one there in case I need it later. And there is nothing in the burner for it to ignite. Oh, okay. Okay. <gasps> Machinery needs more work before it will run. Right. Missing cog wheels. Okay, so I do need to put cog wheels on. I assume they're they're these. Cog wheel does not fit on this spoke. Okay, I guess it fit there. So I'll have to go fetch the others. Which is annoying, because that one was all the way up here. There's one. Actually, is that... I think there was another one. Wasn't there one in here? Or am I totally no yeah, there was. Hmm. Guess I can't really carry two. Jeez, I sure made a mess of this place. <laughs> Got me well trapped in here. something, but I'm just going to ignore it and hope it goes away. <laughs> uh. Okay, so there's three cog wheels fitted. Will it do anything now? Needs more work. It's got... What else does it need? No? Oh, uh, well. Maybe, um... Maybe I need to put fuel in here? Did I break up any of those boxes? starting to lose it here. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Well, it's wait, was that the only Oh no, there's this room as well.
Oh, what is this? Is this coal or something that I could put in there? Is there another lump I can grab? I think this might be coal anyway. I can pick it up. Oh, this might need to be on for the machinery to run. The burner is now full of coal. Sweet. Now it's going. Machinery needs more work. Uh, work on yourself. Okay, so the burner is going... I don't... What on here is... Find a way to start the engine. So I'm assuming this is the engine that powers the elevator, but what, what is wrong with it other than the cogs? Oh, it may have had something to do with the um missing um pieces on the other the parts in the other room. Could be a, a whole connected machine. There are these pipes running all over the place. <laughs> Was it in here? I oh, know, this is the pressure valves. Okay, so... Leave those alone for now. Right, so these flow. Okay, I think I need to find these. I said something about them being in the study, so let's... I actually might pause it when I get back to the, to the uh, study. So I, just so I don't have a whole lot to upload. Well, actually, you know what, I think I'm going to keep playing, but I'm going to, this is where I'm going to end whatever upload it is. This will be like the third part that I upload, so, um, yeah, because I don't want to make too long videos. So I'll see you next time on Let's Play Amnesia.